You can imagine that the grain, specifically malted barley, is the heart and the soul of our brewery and every other brewery. What we're doing that's different is we're custom malting for each grain. We're not even saying they're the best grain, but if you want that grain and you're a brewer or a distiller or a baker and you like the flavor it imparts, then we want to be able to make that for you. Our goal, having met uh, Wayne Carpenter and the people at, at Stagett Valley Malting Company is to work toward sourcing our, our raw material, our barley, from specific farms. That's where Washington State University comes in. They are a fantastic source to help us in determining characteristics of various barleys that are being grown uh, on experimental plots in Skagit Valley and helping us make a determination as to which ones would have characteristics that would be appropriate to the beers that we, we brew or that we would like to brew. So in addition to, to breeding for milling and baking, uh, we work with, with distillers, maltsters, and, and brewers as well. And it's quite similar in my PhD students work on both. So they, they work directly with maltsters as well as millers and bakers and brewers. The work that, that Steve Jones and, and his colleagues uh, up at uh, WSU Mount Vernon are, are doing is, is very exciting to us because, uh, because they're, they're really the only folks in the country who are working on, uh, on, these, on, on not just new strains of barley and, and kind of finding, uh, finding the next big thing in barley, but they're also interested in the preservation and the, the revisiting of some heirloom uh, varieties of, of barley. Uh, and that's very interesting for us because that's the tradition that we come from. Um, so I see uh, a future that is, uh, that is whiskey distilleries, that is brewers, that is um, in, man, in many ways what, what has happened in wine um, with the enology programs at, at WSU and elsewhere that we see science and, and academia pushing the envelope for what can be done in terms of in terms of production and quality and consistency. You know, see a, a craft beer brewed in Seattle and know that that was your barley and uh, and Wayne Carpenter's machinery and everything that made that work. That's really exciting stuff, and it's it's something I think everybody can get behind. Where can local greens go? I think no place but up.